guys, for those of you that don't know, my name is Raymond11 and welcome back to another episode of the World SMP. I would just first like to say thank you guys so much for the support on last episode of World SMP. I understand though that UHC may not be your favorite thing. But don't worry, UHC will end at the end of this week. No spoilers or nothing, but it will. Uh, it'll end, uh, I think Saturday is the last episode. Or no, Friday. Wait, I don't even know at this point. Episode 6 is my final episode, so I think it should be like th at the end of this week. So don't worry, um, that will be all over. And I think I may upload like a highlights video of it. Um, Cora did a really awesome highlight video that's like the funny moments of the of it. So um, we're probably going to do that. Um, but yeah, you guys have been it really left a lot of great support and a lot of awesome comments on the last build with Mads. Um, I'm going to be working again with Mads on this project while we talk. Uh, Mads is in Discord, but he's just muted for this uh, episode um, because I wanted to talk to you guys about a topic. Um, but while we do that, I want to build a new quote unquote shop. Um, it's really a mini game, um, but it is a shop and uh, it's going to make uh, me some mo moolah. Um, and uh, I, I I guess Mads can also have some profits. Mads, do you have the lapis? Oh, you don't have... <laughs> yeah. Do you have the lime dye and lapis? You Maybe not lapis, because I didn't really tell you to get lapis. But I, if you have lapis, that'd be great. Um, we can place down the floor. Um, we are going to making something really awesome, though. I'm really excited when the full project will be done. Uh, we're not going to do the whole project today because it is going to be a pretty massive project. Uh, but we are going to get a huge chunk of it done uh, today. Um, we are going to be building a bowling alley. Uh, World SMP lanes. I don't really. I'm still working on the title. Leave a comment down below if you have a better title than that. I do want it to be World SMP themed because um, I do have like. We're going to be building with World SMP colors, so like the blue and the uh, the green. Um, so it will it'll be world themed. So if you could sort of, you know, put some cool I names uh, in the comments, we'll get we'll tr pick some of you guys' names. But we could do World Lanes or um, World A World SMP Alleyway or something like that. I don't know. Uh, you guys can sort of fiddle around with some ideas. I don't have <laughs> I don't really have any ideas for it. Um, but today I wanted to talk to you about something that um, has been on my mind and it's something that this guy right here has talked to me about a little bit and has been wanting to know and a lot of you guys have been, uh, tweeted me um, asking about it too. Um, a few days ago I tweeted that I've been thinking about making a new channel or I've been like sort of in that you know demotivation mindset and like wanting to make a new channel um and everybody is like why would you do that and some people are like um you know whatever you choose i will we'll support you through it yada yada first off th to everybody that comments stuff like that or tweeted me stuff like that thank you so much that really means a lot and uh it really shows like dedication uh but recently and i think it's not necessarily my fault and i just want to give you my thoughts on it and the reasons why i would want to or the reasons why i won't um but recently, I've been having thoughts about making a new channel and, and thinking about what if I did make a new channel, you know, what are the pros and cons? And for the longest time, I've wanted to, to do make a new channel. Uh, I have been thinking about this for quite some time. The only thing that's holding me back is World SMP. Um, not like I'm afraid that I'm going to get kicked, of course, because, you know, that's sort of impossible. Um, but the fact that, uh, oh, I think this is... Um, Dang, Mads, our whole design is one too low. Or, yeah, one too low. Um, basically, the walls are a little bit too uh, too tall. Um, the, not, not because I'm getting kicked, but because uh, um, I have so many memories on this channel right now uh, about World of SMP. I have four seasons uploaded, um, over 200 episodes, and uh, I just feel like if... If I made a new channel, it wouldn't feel the same because, you know, this is not where everything is at, you know. And we would start, like, on Season 5 or we would start somewhere weird and it would just be like, Hey, I am actually the owner of World SMP and uh, if you wanted to see my past seasons, um, you can go over to this channel. I just feel like that would be really weird. Um, so I don't want to do that. Um, I just also feel like I have... Uh, let me actually look right now. I have, like... 600 videos or something like that. Do, 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 do. Let's see where it's at. Video manager. 
I have 604, this will be my 640th video. Um, and that's a lot of videos and that's a lot of memories as well. Um, and it just, starting over, I, it, I and I wouldn't delete the channel of course, right? But it's just that fact of keeping everything together and I just, I just it wouldn't feel, it wouldn't feel right. And these are two stupid reasons as to why I want to keep this channel, I guess. Um, why I would like to make a new channel is because of the fact that a lot of people on this channel are subscribed to me only because I own World SMP. And that is something that I don't think I'll ever bite, I guess, or ever get rid of. Um, but I do want to, I do feel like if I made a new channel, it would really soften the blow because I feel like at this point, you know, people either know whether they're going to be in ever or not. And um, it just really is just demotivating when you know you have I have like almost 1.4k and uh, some of my videos are barely breaking the boundaries of a I mean, hundred views sometimes and that brings me to, like it could be YouTube messing up because I did witness full-fledged YouTube messing up um two UHCs ago like the two UHC episodes ago it took for like three hours for my my video to actually get to sub boxes and then I checked on one of my accounts and it didn't even get to sub boxes um, so YouTube's unreliableness could be a huge factor in it but I don't think it's the main factor um, and the thing is it's like I now the other solutions like oh well just you know improve you know and just or just make better content and I've asked and I've I've tried to see like what I'm doing wrong, but like nobody wants to leave like constructive criticism. Um, a few people say like you like my rants, but I also just don't want to be. I don't want you to like me because I rant about you know drama or problems. If that makes sense, like that's not also like I'm not leafy. If that makes sense, like I don't want that to be um, my platform either. So there's a lot that goes into it other than just you know the. Uh, the heart these facts right here if that makes sense um and i i i probably will not um because of another reason like the fact that uh i'll be going to college soon and so i don't even know what the option of youtube will be um uh, one idea was that i would i would go to college and i would see how uh i can't believe that just happened i would see how like college works and then either make a new channel and start like fresh in college or um you know whatever we would do then um but it's i'm not i'm not i'm not wanting to make a new channel because you know people know about my channel or um stuff like that like there's actually i did some like research and, and looking at reasons why other people made new channels and most of the time people make new channels for stupid reasons um i've seen a lot of stupid reasons and i feel like my reason is 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 decent um i've seen many times now people have commented on the fact that like my subscribers are are inactive or my view count is not up to par and i don't know it really hurts my feelings for lack of a better term um because there's physically nothing i can do about it you know i'm just in that patch where there's nothing you can do and when i when when i see youtubers that have a substantially low sub count compared to me and they're getting triple the views and triple the support it's it's very demotivating and it's very um it's very like hindering um and especially stuff like that is outside of world like i when i try to upload things that are not world smp and it doesn't get near the same support that's also very demotivating because it's like if there is no world then there is no rayman 11 if that makes sense so there's a lot that goes into this this thinking process not just um views it's just the fact that i don't feel like i'm a like a content creator i feel like i'm the owner of world smp if that makes sense um i was wondering why there was so much light here it's because this mad's burning up my nether tunnel uh i don't know if i have a good screenshot of the uh this side mads other than this um so yeah that's that's my process i wanted to let you guys in i wouldn't and another reason that, like i guess i i really got these thoughts is because people that i didn't expect to make new channels are making new channels like uh um like 
Prez made a new channel and he had like 2.5k or something like that like he was even farther along than I was and he made a new channel and that sort of like gave me that sense of well I mean 12 oh yeah 12k way bigger my bad I knew there was a two um, that really gave me the sense of well like I mean he can make a new channel so I don't understand why I can't um, so there's a lot that goes into it other than just uh, other than just the fact that views and stuff like that so that's my mind mindset i guess that's where like my my brain is sitting um like i said probably not what everybody agrees with and the reason what everybody wants to hear um but it's the truth i guess it's like what i've been feeling and that doesn't i i know what i could be doing better when it comes to youtube um i have been watching a, a really great youtuber that i, I i've honestly I, i'm in I'm inspired by and he's one of my new favorite youtubers and hopefully uh, a very good friend if you would consider me a good friend uh, Sam so he's our new 2d graphic designer he is freaking amazing um, I, I am watching his videos every time he uploads uh, he and he's like he's like a new role model of mine I would guess and uh, I think that's really awesome because he has like 150 subscribers um, go check him out he, he's on the main panel I'll probably add him to my uh, sub box honestly um, I'm going to try to get a new overlay intro from him because he does, uh, he's our 2D graphic designer. Um, and he just, uh, his uh, work is phenomenal. Um, his whole quality is just amazing. Like it's, if it appears to me that he had like 15 K in restart or he had like, honestly, I could see him having like 150 K and then, uh, and re and restarted. So it's, uh, it's freaking insane. You know, his quality and with his, uh, it's his sub size. Um, if you place down a sign with a stack, it breaks. It doesn't put down a stack. Oh, that's weird. Did you get the whole stack back? I would assume not. Honestly, that's not. I got one sign. Rip, rip. Um. But yeah, I I I wanted to talk about that. I apologize if this is sort of like a dreary video and not really upbeat. Um, but a lot of people asked about it on Twitter and I said I was going to mention it and talk about it in a video and I don't want to leave people in the dark either. I want people to, I want you to be aware of how I feel and I don't have the item frames by the way, man. So I'll probably come by and do all that kind of stuff later. Um, but I, I, I want you guys to be aware of the, my mindset and how I feel so that you guys are also, you know, aware and, uh, cause that's all you really can be, I guess nowadays is is aware um so let me r real quick explain uh what we're what we're doing uh or everything about this place and then uh we'll probably end it off there um a little bit of a shorter episode today uh but i just wanted to i wanted to talk about that topic i i posted on twitter too um the feedback on twitter really spiked today as well um and i'm going to talk about this a little bit more in my like February update video uh, more in depth and looking and show you some numbers too because uh, I also have like a another theory um, everybody's gonna probably say like rain you can't worry about the views rain but like if unless you do YouTube you 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 don't n realize that like we you, views is what keeps us motivated right like we could if nobody's watching your content, what's the point in making content? Does that make sense? And so, yeah, you can't worry about the views in a sense that, like, in a certain mindset. Um, but some people, you know, if you do YouTube for a job, um, you definitely need to worry about views. And and it, it views shows you what people are interested in, you know. And so there's a lot of technical other stuff that goes into it. Um, but again not really the time nor the place and i thought i could make it with the last of my blue uh, but i could not so um this is actually uh a really gonna be an awesome project i was thinking about this episode working on uh, the nether tunnel again but i also feel like part of the reason why views are sort of dropping is because we keep working on the same stuff over and over and uh it's getting repetitive as well and so i thought we should start a new mini project to sort of get your mind off things and um just do something new uh so let me explain this this is uh the the alley uh the bowling alley um 
It's still a work in progress. I'm still trying to, uh, we're still, uh, working, working on it, of course. Um, but Mads has an awesome, awesome idea. And the reason why he's helping right now is because, uh, of his idea. He wants to do laser tag over here. So this is all going to be his sort of area over here and what he does. I'm not going to help at all with this, um, because he's not going to help me at all with the, at the bowling alley. Um, portion so make sure to check out his videos for when he starts working on this this may be done before this gets done um, but it probably won't be uploaded knowing Matt's <laughs> um, but over here we have sort of like the uh... oh yeah oh yeah sorry thank you um, it's going to work like the spectral arrows and so um the only problem with the spectral arrows Matt's I figured out is that uh, how long they last I guess is going to be like I don't know how long your points and stuff um, but how it's going to work is you're going to use bows and you'll shoot spectral arrows, I guess. And uh, we'll probably change the scoreboard team so you'll have the blue team and the red team uh, when you start the game. Um, and uh, you shoot it into you uh, and then you'll light up. And that's how you know if you got hit or not, okay? And so, uh, and then you just sort of calculate the points and it'll be pretty cool. Um, he he'll work all that out. Echo Lanes, though, or Bowling Alley, um, I already actually did a bowling alley on season one of World SMP, so a long time ago. And the system hasn't really been updated or changed. And I haven't really figured out a way to um, to do uh, to do it any better. Um, but we'll get into how it really works and some more stuff. I didn't really I knew I wouldn't have time. And I also didn't really want to do another speed build because we just did one. So um so yeah, we'll uh, we'll work on this when it comes to this. Probably not next episode, probably in a few episodes. Um but yeah, I wanted to go for like a retro theme, and so we came up with this floor pattern here. Um, and then I don't like I said, and then I think over here we might have like a leaderboard type thing or some rules or how to play. Um, over here you'll pay, and then it will shoot uh, your shoes and a bowling ball. Um, there's actually a he player head that we'll use for the bowling ball, which I'm pretty excited for. Um, and then you'll play over here. We'll we'll set up two lanes. I feel like two lanes is more than enough. Um, but of course we can always expand if we ever want to. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys understand where I'm coming from. Um, I don't mean for this to be such a like down video. I did want this to be sort of uppity and uh, energetic and stuff like that. I do want to be more energetic in my videos, I guess, and be a more amplified version, uh, <laughs> amplified to any version of world um, with uh, my content. I feel like I'm sort of lackluster and, and might be a little bit boring um, sometimes. Um, I thought that that was the way I wanted my channel to go. Um, I wanted to be something where if you wanted to relax and not be, you know, your heart pumping, uh, you would watch me. But I, I realized that not everybody's into that. And that's sort of uh, what I'm going to have to go with. You know, you got to play to the crowd. And the crowd's not wanting to be chill like me. They want positive vibes. They want energetic vibes. And so uh, hopefully we'll get back into that. But thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for your constant support. And you guys make everything possible. Make everything worth it. And I really do appreciate it. Um, we're going to hit episode 75 and episode 100 soon. So I'm very excited. I hope you guys are too. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like down below. Hashtag Bowling Alley. And we'll see you guys next episode. Bye. Oh, 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 oh.